Hi, my name is Adam, and I have a science discovery to show you today. Earlier, when I was talking on the phone, I looked down, and there was this creepy bug with lots of legs crawling straight towards my toes. When my mom heard me shriek, she came running into the vacuum cleaner and vacuumed it up. But when I looked inside the part of the vacuum cleaner that holds all the stuff, it was still alive. Yuck. So my mom and me got it out and um, put it into this jar here. It's called, um, well, its scientific Latin name is Gira Cleopatra. Come on, little thingy. And there it is. Ah! It's alive! I thought it was dead. Um, this bug is called a house centipede, but it doesn't really have a hundred legs like you would think. It just has 30. Um, it is actually useful, and it doesn't harm you unless you pick it up and handle it roughly. It will bite. Um, it will eat like bugs, like um, cockroaches, and bed bugs, and other things that are bad for your house. So it's actually a good house bug. Um, it takes its little back hind legs here, and it will pounce and inject v um, venom into its prey. So I think that's gross. Yeah. Um, it. Um, it will live up to six years, and it can grow up to t two inches. That's big. Um, I think it's really cool. Um, it has really sensitive antennas, as you can see. So it will actually put them in front of itself, and it will sen if it senses a bug, it will run really fast and jump on top of it. Yeah. Um, it likes dark, creepy places like crevices and stuff in the basement of your house. It also likes woodwork. Um, I think um, we have a fireplace over here. And I think when my dad brought in some wood, it probably came off of that. Or it was living in our house before that. Um, it is like a night bug, it's like nocturnal, like a bat. And it's really creepy. Oh, it's moving again. Why is it still alive? I don't know. Maybe it wasn't dead. Ugh. Well, do you have anything else to say about it? Um. It's all, oh. its legs are all curled up right now, right? Yeah. Um. Can you flip it over? Yeah. Um, so we can see the top of it? Just take a card and flip it over. Yeah, I'll try. You're still afraid of it, huh? Mm-hmm. I dare you to touch it with a finger. No thanks. Oh, he hopped! <laughs> <laughs> What's he doing? Okay. <laughs> um, take it, a card and flip him over with a card, like a pencil, you know? You wanna? No, like, touch, yeah. <laughs> oh. You wanna? Oh, well, do you, have, oh, she, do you have any other interesting facts about um, him? If one of its legs is trapped, it will actually, like, let come off, and it can regrow legs and other stuff like that. Hmm. It's all again. Um, they can be found almost anywhere, mostly in North America, South America, um, Madagascar, Europe, those places. Um, let's see, I don't know, um, they are fast, like if they want to be fast, they'll run. They have a ton of legs, more than a dog, and dogs run fast, <laughs> so you can imagine. <laughs> <laughs> so the more legs you have, the faster you run? I guess so. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Maybe the more legs you have, well, I wonder what a centipede would do. I mean...
Let's see. Maybe it would trip over a ton of his legs. <laughs> <laughs> he would need a lot of shoes. All right, well, do we want to say goodbye to him now? Mm-hmm. All right. Bye-bye, Mr. Buggy. Let's see.